Jacob Zuma wins court battle to stand in South Africa's election. South Africa's former president Jacob Zuma is free to run in May's general election after an electoral court overturned a ban on his candidacy. Last month, the electoral commission buried him over a contempt of court conviction. It argued the constitution prevented people from holding public office if convicted of a crime and sentenced to more than 12 months in prison. Mr. Zuma, 81, has been campaigning for the new Mokonto Wesuize MK party. A former stalwart of the governing African National Congress, ANC, he is a controversial figure and served as president from 2009 until 2018. A former stalwart of the governing African National Congress, ANC, he is a controversial figure and served as president from 2009 until 2018 when he had to step down because of corruption allegations. He was sentenced to 15 months in jail in 2021 for failing to testify in a corruption investigation, although he only served three months on a healthy grounds. The ruling could have a significant impact on the outcome of the next month's election. Mr. Zuma is the face of a newly formed MK opposition party, which is named after the ANC's former military wing. The ex-president sees himself as the true heir of the revolutionary roots of ANC, once held by Nelson Mandela. Mr. Zuma's court victory means he can now run as the MK's leading candidate. Rather than voting directly for a president, South Africans elect members of the National Assembly. The head of whichever party can master a majority is likely to become the country's leader, although it could put forward another candidate. The ruling will also be a blow to the ANC, which after 30 years in power faces a potential bruising election. For the first time since the start of the democratic era in 1994, the ANC votes share could fall below 50%, several opinion polls predict. Shivan Special Nakai, MRI YouTube. <laughs>